Happy Thanksgiving everyone. Today we're going to show you a quick little video on how to automatically create coordinate systems for your part. This is really helpful if you're doing 4-axis or 5-axis milling as well as MTM uh, lays milling and turning. So normally you can create a coordinate system by going to your coordinate system and create a new one. Click on the face, turn face selection on click on the CS palette and there I have a coordinate system made there. But what I want to show you is how to do it automatically. So let's delete this coordinate system. And it's called uh, Automatic CS. So let's go to our Customize menus and let's click on Auto CS. And there it is right there. Now we can take this and we can drag it up. I'm going to put it right in between these two. So it's right next to the coordinate systems. Auto create. Close this. Okay, now I have uh, about 12 coordinate systems there. So I don't want to do it manually. I want to kind of do it automatically. So I'm going to turn on face selection. I'm going to select each one of these faces. And each one of these faces I have my 12 faces selected I'm going to click on Auto CS and I want to rotate them all at the center this is normally how we program 5 axis whether it's from the your original origin on your part or from the pivot point of your 5 axis machine uh, either way you can do it depends on how you want to program so I'm going to click at CS Origin, at Part Origin, click OK. And now as you can see, now I have my 12 coordinate systems. If I click on each one of them, you can see it rotates to that face. I can always do a Home View, Home View. You can see I can go through each one of these. So you can see I have all 12 coordinate systems created for me automatically. Then of course you can always rename these what you want. Um, if I can spell. If I can spell today. Sorry. So you can rename these whatever you'd like so you know what face you're working on. Now, of course, these don't have to be symmetrical like this is. They can be anywhere on your part, but it just makes it a lot easier to uh, program your part and create coordinate systems automatically. So this is a really nice feature. Now we'll show you what it looks like uh, kind of to finish machining it. So here I have my part. This one doesn't have the other coordinate systems on there. This is just the simple six sides there. But of course, once you program it and you pull off your geometry as you would normally, pull up your coordinate system, create your geometry, what you want to cut, just like you would normally, and then go to your operation, simulation, and you can see it's all done. So easy way to create coordinate systems automatically in Gibbs, really helpful much faster, faster than creating, creating them uh, manually. So I hope this helps. Have a nice Thanksgiving.